at this time, we'd like to call Mother Wilson forward for our announcements. Amen. Give a hand as she comes.
because he got up with all victory in his hands. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When he got up with victory, he said, I got up with victory. Hallelujah. Come on, can we say this? Victory is mine. Victory is mine. Victory today is mine. I'm touching and in the eye of victory. Yeah. 
big mic. Let me get a little push on this mic. Mark chapter 16. All right. Mark chapter 16. And when the Sabbath was passed, Mary Magdalene, the mother of James and Salome, had brought sweet spices that they may come and anoint him. And very early in the morning, the first day of the week, the Cedar Grove Baptist Church, they came into the sepulcher at the rising of the sun. And they said among themselves, who shall roll away the stone from the door of the sepulcher? And when they looked, they saw that the stone was rolled away already. For it was very great. And entering into the sepulcher, they saw a young man sitting on the right side, well, clothed in a long white garment, uh, and they were afraid. Mm -hmm. And he said unto them, Be not afraid. I know y'all looking for Jesus. Uh -huh. yeah. You seek him. Mm -hmm. Was crucified. Yes. He is risen. Yes. He is not here. Yeah. Come and behold place where they laid him. But go your way and tell his disciples and Peter that he goeth before you into Galilee. There you shall see him as he said unto you. For a few minutes I want to talk about there is something special. All right. Uh -huh about Sunday morning. Okay. Amen. There's something special well. about Sunday morning. Uh -huh. You may be seated. Something special. Y'all don't want to sleep on it. Something special yeah. uh -huh. about Sunday morning. Yeah. 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 Father, give us preaching power again as you have done before. Yeah. Uh -huh. Allow us to preach your word on today. We thank you for every soul. We thank you for every situation that we know we can bring it all to the cross. Beneath the dripping of your blood, that the people will see less of us, but yet will hear more of you. Spirit of a living God, in these 17 minutes, Give me power Hallelujah. to tell the story. Yes, yes. I got a story to tell Hallelujah. about some things that I've been through. Yeah, 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 yeah. But my testimony is I'm healed. Hallelujah. Oh, I'm healed. Yes. It is in your name we pray. And together we say amen. amen. Come on, clap your hands one more time. The clap of my God for good to you. Amen. Brothers and sisters, Resurrection Sunday is not just religious piety. Resurrection Sunday is a time in which we celebrate Christ for the redemptive work he did on Calvary's cross right. and how he conquered death and he conquered the grave yes. Resurrection Sunday is also a prophetic occasion mm -hmm. for prophets foretold Dr. West of his crucifixion Amen. and they foretold of his resurrection Y'all remember Isaiah, the eco eye prophet? Amen. He said he will be wounded mm. for our transgressions. Yes, yeah. yes. Bruised oh, for our iniquities. Yes. Yeah. And the chastisement of our peace mm. will be upon him. Yes. Yeah. 
Now watch this. And with his stripes, yes. we're healed. Yes. You miss your time to shout. With his stripes yes. is the reason you're not dead. Yes. With yes. his stripes yes. is the reason why things didn't go the other way. Yes. With his stripes yes. is the reason why you survived. Yes. With his stripes, somebody say, I'm healed. I'm healed. Tell him, say, I'm already healed. The psalmist also prophesied about his resurrection in Psalm 41 through 3. The psalmist said, I waited patiently for the Lord, and he inclined unto me and heard my cry. He brought me up also out of the horrible pit. Y'all ain't in the text. Watch this. Out of the miry clay and set my feet upon a rock yeah. and establish my Lord. Yeah, yeah. And he had put a new song. I wish I had a witness here. Yeah. In my mouth. Yeah. Even praise unto our God. Yeah. Many shall see him yeah. and fear and shall trust in the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. The Lord Jesus himself prophesied over his own life. Yeah. And said, destroy this temple. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And in three days, I'll do something. Amen. He said, in three days, I will raise it again. Yes. Yes. I wish I had a witness, y'all. He, he prophesied over his own life. On, when he said, no man takes my life. Yeah. I got power to lay it down. Uh -huh. And I got power to raise it again. Yeah. Do I have a witness? And so y'all, it has been said, watch this, uh, it's crazy to talk about uh, to everyone, but not talk to yourself. Yes, yes. And Jesus, uh, watch this, was just that crazy that Jesus uh, talked to him own self. Yes, yes. Told him own self, uh, listen, in three days, we're going to get up. Uh -huh. and, and every once in a while, you got to tell yourself, uh, it ain't going to always be like this. Every once in a while, you got to learn how to tell yourself that God is going to bring me out. Yeah. Every once in a while, you got to learn how to tell the enemy that I am coming out of this. Every once in a while, I wish I just had about two witnesses that would open up your mouth and say every once in a while, serve a God. Let's go turn it around. Uh, can I get one witness here? Uh, every time uh, I turn around, uh, and I serve a God uh, that keeps on blessing me. Uh, you want to look at a neighbor uh, like you've been born again uh, and tell your neighbor, uh, say, neighbor, uh, don't look at me now. Uh, I wish I had a witness here. Uh, they can throw you in a pit, uh, and you can look at me now. Uh, but if you give me three days, uh, it ain't no always uh, be like this. Uh, if you give me three days, uh, I'm going to lift up my head again. Uh, if you give me three days, uh, I'm going to smile again. Uh, if you give me three days, uh, I'm going to lift up my head, uh, and I'm going to give God praise. Uh, if you give me three days, uh, you want to open up your mouth uh, and let the enemy know uh, it's Sunday morning. Uh, look at your neighbor uh, like you've been born again uh, and say, neighbor, uh, it's Sunday morning. Say, I'm glad that it's Sunday morning because I heard David say, I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. So when we look at Mark, we see something about Sunday morning. Because the Bible says that they came to the tomb. Ain't the Lord all right? Huh? Which it means to me huh? that on Sunday morning, huh? we got a service to render. Huh? And I don't know huh? who I'm talking to, huh? but I'm nothing more. Huh? 
than a servant of God. Is there any other servants? Huh? You want to slip up your hand huh? and let the enemy know huh? I'm a servant of God. Huh? I'm on the battlefield huh? for my Lord. Huh? I promise him that I huh? would serve him until I die. Huh? I'm on the battlefield. Huh? Can I get one witness here? Huh? But not only huh? on Sunday morning huh? is there a service huh? to be written. Huh? But I got one more for you. Huh? There's a stone huh? that needs to be rolled away. Huh? And I need you to know huh? that there's some things huh? that God will do on Sunday. Huh? He ain't going to do on Monday. Huh? He won't do on Tuesday. Huh? He won't do on Wednesday. Huh? He won't do on Thursday. Huh? He won't do on Friday. Huh? He won't even do it on Saturday. Huh? But there are some things uh, he will only do uh, on his day. Uh, I come by to tell you uh, that Sunday morning uh, it is the Lord's day. Uh, when he sing that song, uh, this is the day uh, that the Lord has made. Uh, we will rejoice uh, and be glad in it. Uh, I don't know about you, uh, but I give God praise. Uh, Cause when I come to church, uh, he wrote the stone away. Uh, what stone? Uh, the depression stone. Uh, what stone? Uh, the anxiety stone. Uh, what stone? Uh, the stone of stress. Uh, the God I serve. Uh, he rolled the stone away. Uh, ain't the Lord all right. Uh, and I got to close now. Uh, but I thank God. Uh, Sunday morning, uh, because every Sunday uh, I got a story to tell. Uh, can I tell y'all the story? Uh, ain't the Lord alright? Uh, he came down uh, for 42 generations. Uh, can I just tell the story? Uh, he was baptized in the Jordan River. Uh, ain't the Lord alright? Uh, can I just tell the story? Uh, he went around uh, doing the will uh, of his father. Uh, lift up your hand uh, and say, tell the story. Uh, he opened up blinded eyes. Uh, tell the story. Uh, he fed five thousand, five barley loaves, shout two fish. Tell the story. Matthew told the story. Mark told the story. Luke told the story. Wilson told the story. Melvin told the story. Kevin told the story. The Pekins told the story. The physician told the story. I know the story. That one Friday for the Hill Paul Calvary. He died. I said, did he die? Open your mouth and say he died. Do you know he died?
Okay, y'all understand that. The horse threw him off. And because he loved the horse, he went back and got his horse. Amen. Right? And got back on that horse. And kept on riding. Yes, Ride on King Jesus. Yes. Let no man Amen. hinder you. Amen. Amen. One more chance. Preacher, I'm coming. I gotta get back to work. If that's you, send that hand up. I, I believe God got work and an assignment for you. Send that hand up on today. Slip that hand up on today. Alright, I told you guys last Sunday these are not just solid rock deacons, these are Cedar Grove deacons. Amen, amen. And um, they're just as members here as they are there. Amen. So the church say amen. Amen. So deacons, I need I need y'all to slip y'all hand up. So y'all need to get on the road that you Amen. guys are beacons of the Cedar Grove. Right. Are you a beacon at Cedar Grove? Yes, okay, you gotta have deacons. Yes, so we don't say Cedar Grove don't have deacons, so That's right. somebody say Amen. Amen. We do. We do have some deacons, alright? Yes. And uh, we'll get their name written down. Y'all give them your name before y'all leave. Amen. Yes, Amen. So y'all let me say this. Have a very, very happy Easter today. Yes. Amen. I know none of y'all don't get drunk, but just be sober today. Amen. Amen. Y'all. I said, be sober today. Yes. Don't get don't get drunk on yourself. Amen. Amen. So say amen. amen. And if you just so happen to have something in your back pocket, be safe with it though. <laughs> Come on, y'all. I, I want to start this offering off today with fifty dollars. Amen. With fifty dollars. Do y'all remember when the, the church did 50 pieces of silk? I mean, 30 pieces of silk? Amen. Y'all remember that? Yeah. Y'all, our musician, thank you, man. I've been on this guy for a long, long time, BMC, and he's over here. God has blessed his hands. Amen. And I'm proud of him. He sat through the whole service today. That's what they Amen. Amen. He sat through the whole service today. Amen. Tell us your name real quick. That's Nate, amen? amen. That, that is Nate, all right? Uh, Chris was with us, and Chris was being late to his his service. <laughs> and so uh, he sent him our way. Can, can the church say amen? Come on, that is. He sent Nate our way. Nate the Great, amen? Amen. Amen. You feel me? Oh, yeah, I feel you. Hey, hey. <laughs> Let's get ready, y'all, for our tithes and offering. Please make a please make a good offering today, Amen. so we can take care of our business. All right, Amen. so we can take care Amen. of our business on today. Wherever you are, just come and. Um, I got a good feeling Kevin gonna be with us for a while. I can feel that. I can feel. I can feel it already. Yeah. Hey Kevin, come pray us out today. Do that for us, man. Pray us out, please. Come pray us out. Now I did such a good job today. Such a good job today. Amen. Lead and pray for worship. Dr. Kate is a licensed preacher. Amen. And we thank God. We thank God for you. Amen. God will send it though. Uh, always will send help. All right? Listen, right before we go, uh, Mama Wilson, I want to tell you I love you. I really do. I love you. I'm just trying to get some love back. I really, I really do. See the road, I love you guys. I really do. You guys are in my prayers all the time. And I believe God is going to do great things. Uh, in this ministry. Amen. Amen. And second, I believe God is going to do great things Amen. in this. Amen. Whatever you do, don't despise small beginnings. Sometimes God wants to see what you're going to do with no Somebody will say amen. amen. I told you I walked into a church with five people and I buried three of them. Amen. It's lonely sometimes, right? Uh -huh. yeah. But God is able. Yes. Yeah. 
We can't talk about resurrection if we don't believe he's able to even resurrect his own church. And put, put people in here. Thank you guys for putting on y'all purple t-shirts. I really, really, really appreciate that. Amen. Uh, even uh, Brother Mike got on some purple back there. Thank you, man. I appreciate you. I'm going to ask um, Dr. Payne to close us out. On your way out, uh, Mama has a basket for a love offering. Amen. And um, if you have something, please put something in there. All right? Amen. And y'all, thanks again. My chief of staff, stand up real quick. That's my little sister, too. Amen. Amen. And I, I want to say this. I want to say this. Last week we were eating. We were, we were eating last week. Sitting down, having dinner. I went to the restaurant. I know that's too much information, but I got to give you that to give you this. By the time I went to the restroom and came back, she was passed out. Passed out at the dinner table. Cold sweat, not coherent. And the first thing I'm thinking is she's leaving. And she's talking. And she starts saying stuff about the church. That even in a moment like that, your mind is still on church. I'm telling her, don't worry about church. We worry about getting you bad, and she passed out again. The ambulance had to come to the restaurant mm -hmm. to take her out. Mm -hmm. And not saying because of what I did, I would not leave that hospital. Amen. Amen. And I waited. Mm -hmm. And we waited yes. Yes. until we made sure mm -hmm. she was okay. Yeah. Yeah. Can the church say amen? Because yeah. you know what I learned? We got to take care of each other. That's right. That's right. You gotta take care of each other. Because you never know when the next time you're gonna see somebody that you need to love. Treat people right. Somebody wanna say, man. I wouldn't know what to do with something. That girl's a draw picture of Manny Wilson. Yes, you remember my mama, don't you? Yeah, you remember Manny Wilson. Yeah, and so be a prayer for her. Amen. I don't told her to take a break. Not from coming to church. To take a break from church work. And she won't do it. Somebody ought to say amen. 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 But we thank God. And she picked me up this morning well, and brought me to church because I ain't got no car. Right? Amen. All right. Pray us out. Y'all, if you have a love offer, please give it. We do have Easter baskets now. If you know a child that's not here and they want one, um, you can take some for grandbabies if you need to. Uh, and things like that. So the Shannon, uh, so the Shannon, she was stabbed. Yes. We're going to make sure whoever wants an Easter basket or two, I want you to make sure they get it, okay? Amen. Come on, give God some praise. I just have one thing to say before I pray us out of here. It's been a blessing to be here. Yeah. It's been a blessing to see my brother. Amen. Amen. When he brought up Maddie, it just kind of touched me because I... He didn't know, but Deacon, but uh, Bishop Broaddus and me and the Deacon just to go over to her house Amen. at Amen. that time. Amen. And it's just, it's just a blessing to be in the house Amen. one more time. Amen. And I promise you guys, it will not be my last. Amen. Let's pray. Oh, Heavenly Father, I thank you for this day, Father. Yes. Yes. Most of all, I thank you for the word. Yes. And I ask each and every one of you guys to carry this word with you today. Yes. Don't leave it on the pew. Because we need it. And it was a great word today. Amen. But as we hit the highways and the byways, I pray that each and everybody be safe. And as they return to the house, let it be the way that they left it. And I yes. know that uh, Pastor Bishop has to go to his other service and yes. let the doors be open as well and um, just bless each and every one in church today. Amen. 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 So we go on hug and tell each other we love you. Amen. 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 Hey, you guys are welcome to come at 10 o'clock. We start service at 10. Y'all come on over and have a good time in the Lord uh, on today if time permits you to. Amen. 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 Amen.